See all this pasta? When the moon hits the sky like a big pizza pie, it's the more Oh my gosh. Alright guys, so it's been a while since I brought out the silver tray, but this is eight pounds worth of pasta I took. You know, I posted that I wanted to do a new series, a new challenge series, and this is actually going to be part one. You know, I haven't actually taken a record of my wins, losses for food challenges, but I'm going to start a new series where I do, don't, don't worry, don't worry, the cheat days are still going to be here, but I want to start doing some food challenges, getting some involvement with, you know, other stuff too. Um, but it's been about 24 hours since I last ate, I've been fasting and uh, this looks really good. I'm very excited. You guys wanted to see pasta, but you also want to see dessert. So if I successfully conquer this and I feel pretty good, plan on doing dessert. I also have a cheat day tomorrow that I'm filming for you guys that I'm gonna announce in my community tab. So if you guys are new to the channel, hopefully give this video a big thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe if you're new. Like I said, we're gonna take on eight pounds of pasta. First ever challenge of this new series. I'm gonna keep the record of my wins and losses. And uh, yeah, I'm very excited. I got the timer so you guys can see where I'm at. Enough talking, more eating. Let's get this going. First challenge I've done in a while, food challenge. So, all right, time to carb up. Let's get it done. Mmm. Head to head meatballs. Alright guys, welcome to the first ever episode of the Epic Eat series. And this was taken from you guys. You guys threw up that you wanted to see. We well, didn't throw up, but you want to see pasta done. Man, I love pasta. It's so good. I'm glad you guys recommended this. Now going in, I didn't know with the weight of the water and everything how much it would come out and to feed 10 to 12 people. Lady in the Tramp style. Definitely a classic, the Lady in the Tramp movie. Um, but this challenge was no joke, guys. It turned out more like spaghetti than it did uh, pasta. So yeah guys, like I said, I'm going to be doing a lot more episodes of the Epic Eats, which is just a food challenge pretty much throughout the week, and then I'll have my cheat days. You guys are in store for the next cheat day. It's my classic foods that I ate that got me fat when I was younger. <laughs> the meatballs are really good too. So what I've been thinking of is I want to do a stacked up burger challenge. This one was pretty good. Um, my dog had to get out of the room because she was just crying to get out. Um, but. Pasta is usually one of the hardest things too for capacity because it expands as you're eating it. It's like I'm carving up for the biggest race of my life. Excuse me. Woo! 
Oh, huh, pasta. Who's a twirler? Twirler noodles. Quarantine spaghetti. It's not nearly as heavy. Sixty minutes. It's like never ending. It doesn't look so bad when there's a mountain of it. Go home. Currently at 21 minutes. It's a lot of pasta. This is pretty much the point where things start to get pretty rough. Um, again, I'm about close to six to seven pounds into this sp spaghetti slash pasta. Looks a bit off, huh? It's a lot of spaghetti or pasta. Oh man, as you guys can see. This is not the most pasta I've ever eaten in my life. Definitely don't want it for a while. Alright guys, clocking out at 25.25. Yeah guys, that is it for this. Pasta done.
pasta one. This is like, like I said, probably about maybe a pound left. Um, there's eight pounds in total of uh, pasta, so. Two hours later. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's officially been two whole hours with burping up meatballs and uh, spaghetti slash pasta. But there's two major things you guys wanted to see, and I thought this being the first video of the Epic series, Epic Eats series, which I want to call it this, um, I'm going to do two things and one, you know, I got to have dessert. But I took a, oh, a mo in one. So, if we end up finishing this one pound pizuki, which you guys see right here, it's pretty heavy. Not, not actually too bad. Um, but if we finish this, we can put a one on there. One and one. So, this is kind of like two challenges together. This is, a, I, I'm full, I'm not gonna lie. But a little bit of time, this is in between. Um, should make things hopefully a little bit better than that that pasta. Because I was looking up that fed. It said between ten to at most twelve people, and I tried eating it by myself. <laughs> so we're gonna try knock out this bazooki. This was uh, I think there's like fifteen servings in here, like 140 calories. Um, do the math. We're gonna eat this, and then that'll be the, the first video for that Epic Eats series. So, no timer on this one. I'm not gonna time myself unless I don't do it, I'll complete it. Oh, that looks good. This is salted caramel, homemade. Well, I mean, it came in a package, and I put it in the oven. It's actually pretty good. I could have probably cooked it a little bit longer. Chocolate chips are good though. Eat. Or at least I have to have a one. My record. <laughs> I tried with the pasta, but man, I couldn't do it. Some people said BJ's, I thought that would be too small. I regret that after all that pasta. It was good though. Spike for the win. I'm glad I showered in between these because I don't think I fit them. <laughs> That's a victory, my friends. One and one for that big eat series. Let me know what you guys want to see. In the upcoming videos, like I said, this will be one. Typically, it won't be two things like a big bazooki and a big bowl of, or a big plate, excuse me, of spaghetti. But you guys, I wanted to go pretty big for the first video, and then what do you guys want to see? Chicken nuggets, burgers, like a burger stack that tall. I've never done a burger stack. I've done the big ones, but I would like to do a burger stack fries like set up food challenges that because restaurants are closed but set up homemade ones but thank you guys for watching like share and subscribe if you're new it's gonna be a new playlist so you get to see a bunch of different videos for the epic heat series and uh yeah comment below
you guys want to see and stay great.